Hello everyone and welcome, my name is Asperger and we are back to Convoy, not exactly where we last left off. And why is that? I was pretty, pretty close to the camp, if you remember correctly, when we last left off. There we go, we were about here. I just crossed this uh, po polygon over here. Polygon, is this is called a poly polygon? I found Rex before reaching this camp. When I picked them up, I found these two turrets. Not only a heavy pulse laser, but also a super heavy, super? Super heavy railgun, which is an amazing gun for the MCV. If you try to sell it, they will give you 80 mats for it. So I guess the only thing I can throw out is this repair drone. And I feel kind of bummed to throw this repair drone because if there is a vehicle that needs repair, it might just blow up and I have no chance of saving it. I don't think I ever had a super heavy railgun, so I gotta get into a fight before meeting the last boss, which is what I'm attempting to do on this episode. I must find uh, an, ep um, an event and I'm pretty sure I'm gonna encounter another fight so that I can learn to use this before the last boss. I don't think I have anyone else to be able to use this gun. I think everyone is pretty well equipped or are they? No, this does the more damage than this one. Oh my god. I'm still improving my vehicle's damage. Even though this only damages health pretty much. But this is effective against all targets, so it might be worth it to replace this heavy MG. So let's do that. We are now gonna target the ethanol place, which is 300 kilometers away. We've completed three side objectives, which is pretty great for a playthrough, if you ask me. And our convoy is looking rad. It is looking amazing. It is worth it off the Top Gear program on the television. So we are in Raider territory. Let's investigate the wreck. You discover several discarded pieces of clothing. Blah, 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 blah. There's no sign of her. The Raiders probably took her. Took who? Someone. Bury these people. Roll out. We're not gonna waste any more time with that. Especially corpses on the ground. Of people we don't know about. They might have the plague. The plague. Okay, let's continue. So let's improve the max we can. Or units. The most important thing is obviously your MCV. So you want to want it to be as upgraded as much as you can. So there we go. I got to max point in all of his stats. Let's see what else could we whoop upgrade. Whoop upgrade? Yeah, whoop upgrade. Oh my god, I'm running out of gas. There we go. That's the boss. And I'm running out of gas. But I think I still have enough to reach that point because the boss is like a magnet. It will run to you once you reach that point. So let's go. Are we fully prepared? I don't think so, but let's do it anyway. Here we go. As you near your spaceship, ready to fix it up and leave this planet once and for all, you spot an enormous hovering battle machine. You have made it quite a name for yourself on Omek Prime, fighting the different factions with blatant disregard for the established distribution of power. Your meddling in your, our affairs ends now. Two smaller vehicles move in to flank you as the monstrosity powers up its weapons and approaches. You have no choice but to fight. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Now it's the moment. All right, so the boss will show up, but uh, he will be followed by some backup. So we got to get rid of the backup first. So let's do that. Okay, here we go. I have all my guys ready up. Okay, where are they? Where are they? Where are they? I'm ready! These are the first two. I think the boss doesn't show up immediately. It still takes some time to show up. So you guys are gonna... You know, I'm gonna put all of them. I'm gonna focus entirely on these guys. There we go. And I'm gonna stun that one. If I can. Uh, oh my god, I'm stunned myself. God dang it. Cannot use my MCV now. Alright, but everyone is focusing that guy, which is somewhat good. There we go. Let's try to avoid... No, no, no. You're gonna stay over here. My god, my MCV is taking a lot of damage. This is not great. I wanted to stun this guy, but he was faster than me. Let's put the railgun and the laser on him. There we go. Let's put the shield up. Let's use everything we got on him. There you go. Maybe, just maybe the MCV can finish him up all alone. Come on. There we go. Perfect. That guy's almost down, so you're gonna get out of the way and you're gonna finish up this guy or help finish up that guy. Okay. Everyone change to this fella. 
There we go, things are looking good. This guy took a lot of damage, man. Not entirely sure why, but this guy took a lot of damage. Okay, you need to move over here. Okay, he is taking a lot of damage, so he's gonna be down in no time. Uh, come on, fire at him. This guy cannot target him? Why? You should be... There you go, now you are. Alright, done! Now, let's see. These guys need to be up front because they have a short range. These guys don't need to be as in front as the other ones. Okay! This is where the boss will land, so these guys should be back here. Yeah, you two. And you're gonna go to this side, and you're gonna go to this side. Come on, move faster. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. This is where the boss will land at. Uh, I guess it's a good idea to have this guy over here. This guy doesn't have a huge range, so he should be a little bit more up front. There we go. And here he comes! Alright. Let's see, what are we gonna focus? So as you can see, the boss is a big fella. And I guess you need to destroy every single module on him. So we need to try and focus a couple of them. So you're gonna start attacking this, and you're gonna start attacking this one. Alright, let's try to stun him. I actually don't know what the stun does on the boss. I don't think it actually stuns him. Uh, because he still moves and fires and whatnot. It maybe stuns a module, and that's it. So, you are gonna f keep... No, let's change the target for this one because it's the closest to you. And you're gonna focus this one. There we go. Okay. I don't think I need to be I this close to the boss. So let's move a little bit away. You never know. The more spread out you are, I guess, the better. So let's do that. There we go. This looks perfect. Okay, I have two tanks on one module and two tanks on the other one. Not entirely sure if I should move all of them to one module, but oh well. I don't need to put the shield up on the MCV, do I? Let's stun the module. Let's do that. Let's stun this one. There we go. I should have actually stunned this one because this guy is getting more damage than the other ones. Alright, now this guy will change position and not only that, you will keep rotating and that is what kind of bugs me. Because then you cannot target the module you were targeting at first. Actually, it didn't rotate this time, which is good. It's actually great, he didn't do that. So that module is going down pretty soon. I think this guy will, yeah, will start dropping mines now. So, you drop one over there, so you need to, at all times, keep... I'm gonna stun that module, but I'm not entirely sure what that that's gonna do. You need to move these guys at all times to avoid the mines, so there we go. And you need to pause a lot of times. Believe me, this is the way to face the boss. You don't want to get damaged by any chance. Um, uh, you are still on that guy, you're still on that guy. You should change targets now. Let's go for that one, and you're going to go for that one. I'm not entirely so sure if this mine will hit this guy. It won't. Okay, great. Okay, now you move. Beautiful. You're gonna... Yep, you're gonna move as well. Ah, god dang it. This is why you need your units all spread out. So that you can move between lanes safely. Okay, beautiful. Now I was in time. Move back over there, and you move back over here. Okay, another module down. Now, target that one. I'm gonna try to take the shield out of him with a stun. Let's see if that's possible. Okay, beautiful. The guy's going down pretty fast. Like, compared to my previous playthrough, my private playthrough, which you didn't see. Okay, you need to move up front to hit that guy, and that's dangerous because of the mines. You don't have too much time to move. Alright, he's changing places now. So you are probably going to need to move over here, maybe, and you over here, and you guys need to move back here. Let's see. See, see how what I mean? It now rotated, which means I need to target other modules. Okay, so you're going to target this one, this one. Let's all four target one module. And I have the laser up, which is pretty great. Uh, I don't want you to be in the wo in the way. So let's just try to bring one module down. The railgun is almost up as well, which is great. Are you targeting that module? Okay, we need to stay away from these lasers, so let's do that. There we go. Oh, I remember this. You will just scatter the laser all over the map. So I should have been to all the way to the left so that I wouldn't be targeted by the laser. So I need to move to this side to be less damaged by the laser. I'm not sure if he's gonna... He's gonna hit this guy? I hope not. Holy crap. 
was kind of worried it would hit, my guys. Alright, oh my god, the laser. The laser didn't do anything, pretty much. So, move up front now, and... I don't know, target this guy. See how intense this fight is? This fight is like nothing you've ever seen before in Convoy. You're gonna move over here and attack this one, and you're gonna attack this one and move over here. There we go. And the laser needs to be changed, but I don't want to hit my guys. Maybe I can change it now. Let's try it out. Okay, I think these guys are safe. Let's stun, let's stun this module. Oh, and the turret is the turret. The turret is gone. All right. Let's see how this goes now. I don't like this guy to be so close to this one. Uh, and this one is in the way of that one. So let's move it back here. Okay, perfect. And you need to be probably over here or something. There we go. One. Are we looking good? I'm not sure. I'm actually not sure. Okay, that is not great. Okay, let's move a little bit closer. Okay, he's gonna move over there. So far, so good. I think he's gonna go with the mines phase again. So we're gonna move this guy over here. We're gonna go up. We're gonna go, we're gonna go for the same formation we had previously. Let's stun on one of these modules, like that, one, like that one. There we go, we're gonna move up here. Look at the dragon tail, I just love it. I just love it. This guy's stunned, unfortunately. What can I target now? This, maybe? But uh, it is shield, so... I'm not sure if this is gonna go well. Okay, here we go. Move upward and attack this. You're gonna attack this. It's the only target we have, I guess. So let's go with that. Okay, one mine over there, so let's move this guy. My, one my over there, so let's move this guy again. Oh, god dang it, this guy is too close. That's the problem. But I need to be, I need them to be this close, or they won't be able to hit the, the, the boss. Okay, move over here. So, let's see, I want to use the railgun, but I want, don't want to have anyone in front of the railgun. Okay. I, f I seriously hope this is gonna work. I have no one in the road, so I should be able to hit him without hitting my guys. There we go, beautiful. This guy's too close, man, to the boss. That is not great. On this one is also too close. I can still sometimes be able to avoid the mines, but uh, I gotta be quick, very quick. All right, the boss is moving again. I hate this, I hate when they rotate. Okay, try to finish that module, come on, guys. Maybe I can do it when he's moving. Beautiful, we got him. Now, with which side will you face me now? It's a good idea to go all the way to the left now and try to avoid the damage from those lasers. Okay, this is a pretty... This is not a safe way to do things. No, 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 no. It's just uh, go over here. I want to select my other vehicle. There we go. You're gonna go over there. You're gonna go over there. Um, let's see. This guy over here. Where is he? God dang it. Pretty sure he's down there. There we go. You're gonna move over here, and you gotta move over there first, and then back here. Alright, in the meantime, keep attacking them, come on. There you go, that is gonna face me f forward. There you go, I hope I'm... Oh, he's gonna only attack me with one because I destroyed the other one, beautiful. Okay, so this is enough, this is safe enough, so let's just move over here so that we can still hit him. This guy is not gonna hit him at all. Even if we wanted. Let's... Can we... Actually, we can probably stun that turret so that it doesn't do this. But I have all my guys safe, so let's just keep doing it. Okay, things are looking amazing. Believe me, compared to my private playthrough, things are looking really great. Oh, hello! Joining the party, are you? Alright. You, destroy this guy. Let's stun the one uh, in the north, because this is my weakest link. And you guys, you know what to do. Don't move from there, I guess this is a good positioning, at least for now. Okay, alrighty then, that is not a good positioning. Oh my god, and they stunned the dragon! Oh my lord, please, please be able to move before the boss comes down. Oh my god. If that doesn't happen, I'm screwed. Come on, come on, come on, come on, no, 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 no. Move, move, dragon! Dragon! <laughs> oh my god! That was so tight! Definitely. Holy banana nuggets! Alright. Let's tar target the boss with a laser. I think it's a good time to do so. 
It's gonna bring the shield down, I hope. Could have attacked this guy with the laser, but oh well. I'm in hopes that my vehicles can do it pretty soon. Holy lord, I didn't know about this phase. In my private playthrough, I didn't reach this phase. Oh my god, these units can stun. That's the problem. Mixed with this phase with uh, the ex exclamation points, I'm screwed with the missiles. I cannot move them. I cannot move them. So they're gonna be hit. Oh my god, this guy, that guy is almost destroyed. I don't think that guy will survive. But uh, let's keep at it, obviously. I should probably focus more. I only have two of my units in each uh, of their units. I should probably focus more. Come on, move over here and you gotta move somewhere. Let's move over there. Come on, avoid the damage entirely. Come on, he's stunned. God dang it. This is terrible. This is not looking good at all. All right, great, great, great. We avoided that damage. Okay, we should be fine over here. Come on, there we go. One is down. Let's go for the other one. You guys need to attack this over here. All right, we, you need to move closer, so let's do that. Let's stun the guy. I have no idea what should I stun, but screw it. Let's just stun everything we can. Come on, that guy's almost down. Come on. At least there's no obstacles. I'm happy about that, by the way. Uh, if there were obstacles, this fight would be a complete mess. Okay, I'm focusing that uh, module over there. But I think this one is not shielded, so let's go for that instead. Uh, let's get closer. We need to get closer as well, so let's do that. There we go, let's target that module over there. I need to avoid this damage. There we go. Come on, come on, come on, move, 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 move. There we go, beautiful. Okay, we're, done. we're doing it. Let's stun one of the modules. I'm not entirely sure which, which should I stun. Move over there, you move over there, and you need to move as well. Alright. This just shows how important pausing the game is in this game. If you didn't have pausing, this would become a complete mess. This module has so much armor, dude. Not entirely sure if this is because I don't have, you know, enough turrets with good capacity to bring the armor down. These guys don't seem to be hitting him. Is it because these modules are on the way? That is that is awful. Okay, let's move over there. I think that's the problem. Yeah, I think that's the problem. That's why it's taking so much time to go down, because these guys are not in line of sight. Let's stun something. I don't know. I don't even know what. And let's use the railgun. Alright, let's move this guy. This guy's almost down, man. Ah! Come on, hit it. Come on, hit it. This guy's almost down. Oh my god. <laughs> this is not looking great. Come on, let's use the railgun over here. Beautiful, it's down. Now we should probably focus. Oh my god, I went all the way to that point to move this guy's down over here. Okay, move, 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 move. Okay, the mo the boss is moving. The boss is moving, which is not bad. I don't like to have them in the center. It's, it's pretty bad, if you ask me. I guess this is the easiest part, the mines. Uh, at least it, it is not as intensive, I guess. Let's focus that module over there. You too. Okay. Let's take the shield out of it. There we go. Perfect. Come on, now is the time. Let's use the laser as well. This will be perfect, actually. Ah, god dang it. Oh my god, I still was able to avoid that. Perfect, perfect, perfect. We got that one, but what happens now? Because I don't have any other module to attack on this side. Let's see, will he move? Okay, you will move. This means I'm still able to attack him on another module. I'm sorry if I sound super excited or intensive. It's just because this part really is. It really is intensive. Okay, let's destroy that module. I think this is the one that is giving him uh, that shield. So let's get rid of that one. Not sure I can attack him from that side, so... Guys, move over there. Okay, so... You're not close enough. You, get over there. Perfect. Okay, this guy is not attacking that module. I don't think he can reach it. So, move over there. Not entirely sure what phase is this one. Move over there. Okay! It's called the nasty phase, kind of. 
Alright, 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 alright. Everything is looking cool. Let's stun this over here, and I'm not sure entirely why. Okay, we might still pull this off. I was kind of worried, because all my vehicles are almost down, man. I need you to move over there. There we go, you need- I need you to move over there, and you to move over there. Okay, I'm gonna focus the main module, I would say, with this guy. I hope these three can take care of that module over there fast. Okay, things are not looking good for this fella. Okay, let's move this one over there, and you're gonna move over there. Okay, this is gonna free up some room. Okay, great. I'm not sure if he chose this tank. I bet he did. I bet he did. I see a missile coming to his way. Yeah. Come on, come on, guys. You can do it. Almost done with. Let's stun the main module. I guess that is what is fighting the missiles. Okay, great. Now, for the main one. Come on, guys. We can do this. Focus him. Come on. Go, guys. I didn't even use the shield on my MCV, man. I could have used something else on that spot. Oh, my God. He's going down so quickly. And this guy's going down so quickly. <laughs> We're gonna lose this guy. Ugh, come on, let's stun him. Let's stun him. Please. What? What is that? Dude, that just came up. That is not fair. It just built a module on the fly. Okay. Okay, this is gonna look nasty. I think this is gonna go 360. So I think this is a good idea for this guy to just move over there. Like so. There you go. Oh my god, no, what? He's focusing one unit? Is that the problem? This guy's gonna go down. My dragon is gonna go down! God dang it, man. My god. This is looking very, very nasty. Alright. I was not ready for that module. I, I am honest. I was not ready to see that module coming up. No, 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 no. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Let's stun him, let's stun him. There we go. And let's now use the laser on him. There we go. Beautiful. Come on, we can still pull this off, guys. I trust in you. The dragon is gonna die. The dragon is gonna go down. For sure of that. Come on, come on, come on. The dragon and this guy. They both look like, like a dragon, actually. Come on, come on. Okay, okay, now is the time. Yeah, I was just lost the dragon. Ah, uh, who is ramming? No, I don't want anyone to ram. What the heck? What are you doing, actually? Why did I said to him to ram? I don't, I, I'm not sure anymore. What of what I'm doing? Come on, come on! We can do this. Let's move this guy over here. This guy's gonna die probably. I think I'm gonna keep one unit. Come on, come on! Almost there! Come on! Have we done it? That's a huge debris though. Can Do I need to avoid the debris? Hope not. We've done it! The blinding light and deafening explosion fade out and a peaceful silence settles over Omic Prime. With the monster's battle ma machine destroyed, the way is clear for you to return to Spaceship Mercury and finally leave this planet! The collected parts prove op operational enough for Spaceship Mercury to take off. You leave your escort vehicles behind, thank everyone for their help, and load your MCV onto the spaceship! One can only guess what will happen to Omic Prime now that its supposed keepers have been destroyed. But you have no time to worry about it, the next mission awaits. The days of driving a convoy are over, the endless war of Landinar awaits. End game. Ladies and gentlemen, I guess this is it for the very first playthrough of Convoy. Oh, we get to see the ship lifting off. This is pretty cool. Let's see if there's anything else. Probably the credits of the game. Breaking news! Stargate to Nerby Civilization something. I wasn't didn't have enough time to watch that. But here we go, ladies and gentlemen. This is Convoy. This was my playthrough of Convoy. My very first one. You can call it Season 1 if you want to. Now, there is room, there is ideas, there is content for a second season, but I would like you guys to comment on this video and to express your will on this video, to express what you want to see more on my channel by saying if you want a second season of Convoy or not. Why do I say there's content for it? Because you have now probably 
other vehicles to unlock. I have uh, uh, unlocked other vehicles by finishing the this boss for the very first time. And we probably unlocked another MCV as well. And I'm kind of curious to see how it goes. My name is Asparo Jenny. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you on the next video. Bye bye. Thank you for watching everyone, if you are looking for more, feel free to check these suggestions. As a reminder, if you're looking into buying games, consider using my G2A ref link in the description of this video. Ladies and gentlemen, I'll see you on the next one, and remember, stay above the waters.